Time for DIY Friday, and today we're going to learn how to make a cereal box pinball machine. Amy Blaubach, the director of STEM education for New Horizon Academy, is with us here on Mid Morning. Amy, great to have Hi, you back with us. Hi, thanks for having me. I am uh, sort of obsessed with pinball, <laughs> so I absolutely love this idea. Well, this is a clever way to have your kids entertain themselves, especially mm -hmm. with the blizzard coming of a three day yes. weekend. Mm -hmm. So you can take shirt boxes, cereal boxes, we have a big Amazon box here. And what you do is you cut the top off and you can repurpose the top to make the flippers or fins for your oh, pinball sure. machine. Oh, right. And also the base. You can see here where we uh, flip it over because you want a little edge oh, yeah. on your, oh, there's marbles in there. Oh, yep, there So are. that it sits at an angle. So you're using the whole box to repurpose it to make a pinball machine. And of course, your art and craft supplies and as well. And this is all stuff that you already have in your home, oh, so it's easy absolutely. to find. Yeah, uh, pipe cleaners, you can use marbles. Any balls will work. You can use sure. ping pong balls, um, hot glue, tape. So and there's some people can see it, like yeah. something like this, but it looks like you've cut little slits in the side yes. here. Yes. Yeah, Let's there are slits in the side to yeah, insert the flippers, and so then you can make the flippers go back and forth. Um, and you can design easily. your background and have the fun uh, on that side of it, but mm -hmm. there's also, uh, this is physics, really. This is physics, this is the engineering design process, mm -hmm. so you're engaging that imagination, mm -hmm. problem solving, creativity. If something doesn't work, redo it, there's no wrong way, you get to have a lot of fun. Also a lot of art in here too, because I love this one, if you can see it, it says uh, danger zone <laughs> down the here ocean. at the bottom. <laughs> and then they have a you know a beautiful um, rainbow here, I mean the creativity is right. boundless. And then you can have points, we've added points to these, if you get it through certain colorful tubes, you get points, you could add those up, have simple math, just a lot of fun. And if you don't want to make a pinball machine, you might want to make a marble maze where you pick the box up and you tilt it and try oh, to right. get it through the yes. different areas. So you could just be creative as you'd like to be. This is one of those things where the process is really the main event <laughs> the process. here, right? It's really not the end product. I mean, the end product yeah. Yeah. I mean it, it works a little bit here. A little it bit. It does, yeah. yeah. And I mean, you know, you the children, they get far more creative with than we do. And they oh, might yeah. want to use popsicle sticks or something sturdier for the flippers. I mean, oh, right. you just never know where they take it. So it's really fun. And then this is all part of um, our camps at New Horizon this oh, year. Okay. So we're doing an engineering mindset. So all of our camps have engineering components like this where the children are going to be building and creating and then journaling about it. So. Tell us a little bit about the camps. What ages are we talking about? So there's preschool and toddler and also school age. And what our intent behind the school age camps is that you don't go into that backward summer slide. Mm -hmm. right. So that we're going to be doing engineering products all summer long and we're going to be journaling and writing about them so you get the literacy component and some math and everything. Nice. Great. All part of it. Yep. Yeah, be creating. Very good. New Horizon has some uh, at-home activities too that mm -hmm. you can use. Uh, different STEM projects, videos, other resources. Same bit. It's for toddler through school age kids. Mm -hmm. And we have all of that connected for you at WCCO.com yeah. slash links. Right. Amy, thank you. Thank you. Thanks for having mm -hmm. me.